I am at my wit's end with my wife Clara and her chronic lateness. It's been an issue for years, but lately it's gotten to the point where I'm genuinely questioning whether I'm being unreasonable or if this situation is as bad as it feels. I love Clara, but she is late for everything. I'm talking about every appointment, every event, every single thing that requires a set time. It's not just five or 10 minutes either, it's consistently at least half an hour or more. It's gotten so bad that I've had to take over all the important timing-related responsibilities in our household because she simply can't be trusted to be on time. Let me give you some examples. Clara has missed so many doctor's appointments for herself and the kids that we get charged for the missed appointment because she shows up late, only to be told it's already been canceled. I've lost count of the number of times I've had to apologize to friends when we're late to parties or dinners. Everyone knows Clara as the one who will not be on time, and they've stopped expecting her to show up at the agreed time altogether. It's embarrassing, but what really frustrates me is how this impacts our kids. We have two children, both involved in activities like soccer and ballet. Guess who has to take them to every practice and every event? Me. I don't mind being a hands-on dad but it feels like I'm the only one responsible for making sure our family functions smoothly. Clara's lateness means she's missed key moments, games, recitals, even picking them up from daycare. I had to take that over too, because after being late so many times, daycare asked us to please ensure our kids were picked up on time. I've tried everything to help her, setting reminders in her phone, managing her schedule, even giving her fake earlier times to get her out the door on time, but nothing sticks. What makes it worse is that the reasons for her lateness aren't even crucial. Clara gets ready but then spends another half hour or more taking pictures of herself. I get that she likes to look good and take photos for social media, but when it's every single time we're supposed to be somewhere, it's infuriating. Meanwhile, the kids aren't getting fed on time, they're stressed about being late to their activities, and I feel like I'm doing this whole parenting thing solo. The breaking point came yesterday, it was Clara's 40th birthday and I planned a nice dinner for her at a restaurant. I'd invited her family and friends, and I made sure to stress the time to her repeatedly. I even got the kids ready so she didn't have to worry about them. Her family and friends arrived at the restaurant on time and we sat down and waited, and waited. Clara wasn't there. We all texted her, called her, nothing. After about an hour we finally ordered and started eating because people were hungry and it was getting late. I felt embarrassed sitting there with her friends and family, making excuses for her yet again. An hour later, Clara finally showed up. She walked into the restaurant smiling and acting like everything was fine, completely unaware that we had all finished eating. She was ready to order and celebrate. At that point, I was done. I suggested she order something to go, explaining that we had already eaten and it wouldn't be fair to the wait staff to hold the table up just for her. Clara was furious. She said I should have waited for her and that it was her birthday. How could I let her miss her own dinner? She accused me of being inconsiderate and unsupportive. I told her bluntly that it wasn't fair to expect everyone to wait indefinitely while she took her time getting ready. I didn't see the point in making everyone sit through another meal just for her. Now she's not speaking to me, and I'm questioning if I handled it the right way. Maybe I should have sat back down with her, but I was tired of enabling her behavior. I don't think it's right to make everyone else's time feel less valuable because she can't manage hers. So, am I the asshole for letting my wife miss her birthday dinner and not sitting back down with her when she showed up late? Should I have handled it differently, or am I justified in feeling like enough is enough? Let me know in the comments. Let's discuss it.